Hello, I'm Miranda Misson, a principal at TAB Group, and I'd like to share some of the highlights for my latest piece of European research called Decisions in the Dark, Aligning Results with Expectations in European Equities. In this vision note, we look at a range of techniques used by different dark environments to protect orders and optimize execution. And we also examine what the buy side needs to consider when seeking the closest match between the expectations and results when trading in the dark. There are now quite a number of dark environments all along the execution chain, from the buy side crossing networks to the broker crossing facilities and the public dark books. All of them have a differentiated value a unique personality, if you like, and each contributes to the executable liquidity available in the marketplace. But the array of dark choices across the execution chain can be dazzling, and this makes the search for the best dark strategy a challenge. How can you compare and measure what you cannot see? How can you know if an alternative strategy might have resulted in a better execution, lower costs, a decent block, or perhaps less leakage? As dark environments improve in sophistication and regulation changes the landscape, buy-side traders need to understand the different microstructures available to them. Only then can they be perhaps sure that their execution performance will be the tightest fit with their expectations. This means choices must be made in relation to who to trade with, what kind of execution functions fit the bill, the expectation of surveillance and anti-gaming features, and an awareness of the extent to which an order might be exposed to other dark environments. In this note, we explore these topics and what the buy side needs to consider. It's available now at www.tabgroup.com. I'm Miranda Mizen at Tab Group. Thank you for watching.